right, Virgo, let's take a look what's going to be coming your way this 2019 for you, okay? I am so sorry for the delay, but finally it's here. Let's take a look. You know, most of the Virgos this uh, 2019 will have a big decision to make between water sign and a fire sign. Okay, there is a fire sign from the person. Sorry, <laughs> fire sign from the past that will be knocking on your door again. That even though you're already in a harmonious relationship or healthy relationship, this person will still want you know that piece of cake or that piece of happiness that you're currently enjoying and just because that they are so miserable in their own life actually they're the one who's making their own miseries it's not other people they want to you know they want you to be affected by their own misery so it's like misery loves company while your water sign or you know sometimes it could be the other way around since that this is a general reading so it's all, it's already up to you Okay, how to figure it out. But anyway, um, that water sign who will try to, you know, to do their best to make you happy and to give you everything. They will try to understand the situation, but as soon as they found out that you are communicating with this fire sign secretly, aside from, you know, from those things that you're telling to your spouse or to, to this water sign, when they found out that you're doing this right behind them, they're going to be walking away. So be very careful. It might just affect your marriage or your relationship, especially if you just recently got married or just recently moved in. You know, some people, they just don't know how to be happy on their own and they just don't know how to let go. Or they just don't simply know how to be happy for other people and just mind their own business. Well, on the other hand, it's also up to you if you will be letting this person in to your life again. Because it seems like it is you who needs to draw the line. I mean, even if they wanted to, or even if, you know, they keep on pushing and pushing and pushing, and you really don't want it, they're going to get it. But I feel like you also feel weak on the inside for this fire sign. So let's go and take a look. Ah, an affair, which will be starting, or which will be letting up this month of January. <clears throat> okay, now, I know that we're almost halfway through the month of January, but this month there will be some house change or relocation that you're going to be thinking, making, or deciding about, and I feel like you're going to be very happy because finally this is the, um, this is the moment that you've been waiting for and anticipating because you feel like you're, you're getting stagnant in this, you know, in this city or in this place or if you are thinking about moving from one company to another, then definitely it is going to be happening right by the end of this month. Now, 
there is a fire sign who left you or who just turned their back on you and then it's more likely around three months or three years already and this person somehow will just suddenly make a um, you know like a reappearance or will be coming out of the surface out of the blue that even though you don't you're not thinking about them anymore or even though you don't want them anymore they will just you know create their own demand and they would want to reconnect with you at first they're going to be asking for some friendship which is you, you know i mean you're going to be reconsidering it but you have to think about your situation right now especially if you're already in a happy relationship you know that this person doesn't really have any good intention or clean intention because when you were still together they tear you apart they ripped you apart so if this person will be coming back into your life you know and even if they're going to be offering for friendship it's not just going to be friendship at first it's going to be like that and then little by little they're going to be crawling back to you or they're going to be crawling their way up to you like a termite okay to the extent that your foundation will slowly deter or will be crumbling down now when it comes to your now when it comes to your work you will be putting much more effort and i feel like there is something like an achievement or goal that you want to attain that from the darkness or you know right through the storm you're gonna be, you're gonna be seeing much better hope and much better light right by the middle of this month and you will be you know you will be considered for a new promotion for a new position or you know to have a new project or uh, you know to be moved into a new department because there is like a big move or there's like a big decision that you've been anticipating to come that you've been wishing for this to be given to you and right now you know right now this month your your prayers will be heard okay you're you're gonna be very happy and i feel like you will be mingling with your co-workers along with the uh there's like a gathering that they're going to be forming and i feel like some virgos will be receiving their bonus or their rewards or commission okay and um incentives during this month so financially you're going to be doing okay now when it comes to your love life you know some virgos are already in a happy relationship or already in a harmonious relationship yet there's no perfect couples there's no perfect relationship sometimes you're well secured you know your 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 partner right now is very established very um workaholic you're living a life of luxury even if you don't have to work but then your sex life is zero so that is the only thing that's been missing in your life right now or in your relationship but that doesn't mean that you have to consider the other person who is more of a threat to your future into your harmony because this is where the temptation will be coming in because you've been wishing and thinking and you're attracting you know the negativity in your relationship just because that you feel like sometimes your partner cannot satisfy you okay so you will be you will be traveling by the end of this month but the reason that you're going to be giving to your partner isn't what it is okay isn't what it really is or your partner will also be making a um, a journey without telling you where they're really going and you're going to be busting them now for your sex life as i've said okay both of you are just wearing masks you don't satisfy your partner if your partner doesn't doesn't really satisfy you it could be that you're because your emotions are missing your affection you know the passion is gone it's no longer burning especially if you've been in a long-term relationship that is what happens when the two of you become too comfortable with each other there's no thrill there's no excitement like you know each other already it's like ah okay you know I just want to release this let's do it and let's just sleep there's no foreplay there's no you know touching and necking and patting and there's no role playing you know nothing no excitement no thrill no adventure and you're wishing for more action it's like you want hot and passionate and wild sex 
and then your partner is always tired you know they're always working their mind is already like you know um stressed out which is you can't you can't really blame them they they just want to give you a happy life or they just want to give you a good life so they have to work hard and this is something that you need to understand okay so there are some gaps that's going to be happening in the cold turkey that's going to be on the table so you need to you know you need to think of more ways and how to contribute into your dying sex life all right now when it comes to your health be careful with wild animals or be careful be careful in consuming red meat you might ended up having a um like a double dead meat or like a, a contaminated meat okay um, might as well just stick around with the vegetables then migraines um shoulder pain shoulder blades muscle pain arthritis rheumatism heartburn heart ailments um nasal polyp infection eye infection and be careful in getting infected by a virus that is airborne okay plus digestive problems or indigestions and chest pains bronchial problems and sore throat now let's take a look at your singles forecast okay now hmm. singles you are in the competition with someone when it comes to a certain promotion or a, um, like a certain position that you are aiming for there is someone else in your workplace or in your office or company who is also aiming or who wants to have that same spot that you are also aiming even though you already have the recommendation or the good reference from your bosses or from your co-workers this person is also very competitive so be very careful not to slack off and um there's also an air sign and a water sign that will be helping you out okay to make things happen so you're gonna have it back up and I feel like you will also be moving away or moving on from someone who is a water sign person who just did nothing but to betray you or to break your heart. Now, you will also be drinking more than, you know, more than your limit during this month. And I feel like be very careful with that because of your liver and kidney and your boss will be expecting much of your performance much of your appearance and much of your contribution to your meetings brainstorming and you know the formulation of this new project that you're going to be handling they want you to be more on top they want you to be more competitive aggressive and you know be more out there because they appreciate your creative flair okay so this is the time to show down let's take a look at your february forecast
Betrayal in the month of February. Be very careful and you will be traveling again. Although, although there's a good news that's going to be coming your way, but the betrayal is something that will be done by a water sign or by an air sign. All right, February, hmm, good and bad news, okay? Uh, there is an offer that's going to be coming your way. I also feel like this is regarding the, uh, the position that you're applying for, which is it will be given to you. Changes, positive changes that will be coming and that will be happening, you know, when it comes to your career and your workplace. And uh, there will be a brand new beginning or a brand new chapter that you're going to be initiating soon now you will also be moving away and walking away from an old place and you will be keeping yourself walled up and aloof from other people yet despite of this somebody will be betraying you that is you know around your workplace someone who is younger than you an earth sign and someone who is also very ambitious competitive and ambitious as well while you will be traveling or you you have to attend a um, like a conference or like a training or something like that there's a travel that you have to make that is related to your job okay and then there will be good news now on the other hand and there is also a water sign that will you know that will be betraying you so be very careful with this now you will be setting some high goals and high targets when it comes to your work to the extent that you're already isolating yourself you were so afraid okay because you're guarding yourself too much you want to protect yourself from those who also wants to have the same you know same thing as you despite of you being 
you know, being too isolated and walled up and guarded and distant from other people. They are the one who will try to get close to you and you will be invited frequently in some gatherings or parties. But while you're busy with this, someone will not really waste their time digging up. Okay, digging up and researching and doing something more about your background and more about what you have done in the past to create a bad reputation for you. If you're not going to get fired, then at least people around you who seems to trust you or who seems to like you will, you know, they just want to, they just want those people to look at you in a different way, but they're not going to be successful. Okay, and because of this, this person will be caught around third week of this month and they're going to get sacked. So there goes the justice for you. Aside from that, you will continuously celebrate and be more closer with your peers and, with, you know, with the higher um, officers in the management or higher executive. And you're going to have enough backup. They just want to remind you that not to get involved with anything illegal or to abuse their trust, which is you will definitely assure them. There is also an accident that will be happening, but it will be very slight or minor. Now, oh, there will be a misuse of a machine, and that is the accident that I'm seeing. Now, when it comes to your um, love life, your marriage or your, you know, your the harmony in your relationship will continuously flow, but there will still be some push and pull that's going to be happening. And as part of this, you will try to work on your differences and there will be a decision that you have to make. As part of you making an effort to, to come clean and transparent and honest, your partner will be, let's say, doubting your loyalty or doubting your moves. Okay, And this is the reason why you're going to be feeling a little bit... Um, a little bit uh, aloof or a little bit, um, what do you call this, like um, hurt and distant, okay? You will be forgiving your partner for all those accusations and uh, suspicions that they're going to be doing and making, but it's, you know, it needs to be curved down as early as possible. Don't let it flare up uncontrollably. And... Health, sorry, when it comes to your sex life, it seems like both of you are working as a team, okay? And you will also try to do some different angles, different stimulations, and, you know, even if you have to use some tools. But then you will be more into role-playing, okay? Uh, and I feel like you're going to be... You will like it in different or odd places, especially during the evening or during at night. And uh, just be very careful in getting caught, okay? But aside from this, both of you will be teaming up to work on your sex life and to work on your, you know, to work on your, uh, well, sex life, okay? To, to make it work and to reignite the passion that is slowly fading. Now, when it comes to your... Um, when it comes to your health, you will be feeling more lethargic and uh, fever and flu, depressed a little bit because of, you know, what's going on with your personal life and you will, you need some sleep, okay? You will also be feeling a little bit burned out right by the middle of this month, so you need to break away for a little while from all this, you know, from all this, um, what do you call this? A stressful environment and uh, all people will be coming to you that even though at 3 o'clock in the morning at 12 midnight they're gonna be calling you just to ask something about work okay so you need to have enough sleep you need to have enough rest and you also need to eat more and um, might as well go organic okay so that it, you won't feel heavy and bloated and uh, dig indigestion heartburn um, high blood pressure uh just be very careful with the possibility of stroke okay but might as well check out with your doctor and don't go for your self-medication it's okay if you know some herbal stuff that can really help you out but aside from that if you will be experimenting it's not really advisable for you at this moment and also take care of your eyes don't work too much in the dark let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way
Okay. You feel so alone right now, okay, or this month of February, and you're feeling like if someone could just, you know, help you out and give you some guiding light and give you some guidance as to where you should, your, as to where, where, sorry, where your life should be going and um, your path where it should be directing you. Because it seems like you're only following the signs and symbols, but you're not yet clear why there are certain things that's been occurring and happening there will be happiness that will be coming to you you know you just need to be a little bit more patient by the end of the month and i feel like if you're you know don't look for a relationship don't look for someone that person will be coming into your life at the right time at the right pace when you're ready okay for the right reason but aside from that, you just need to be a little bit more happy, you know, on your own for now. And whatever that's been missing in your life, you also have some childhood issues that you need to sort out. You also have some anger inside you that you also need to sort out. And because of that, you are incurring and you are inviting more bad karma. That's why you've been going through this. All right. And I feel like you will still be traveling, okay, by the end of this month. And mm. it seems like there is a truth that you will be learning about this person from the past. And don't react. Okay, because it seems like you're the next, you know, the, the moment that you knew about this truth, about this revelation or about this secret, you're just going to grab your phone and dial this person's number. Don't, don't do that because you're the one who's just going to, you know, be pushed on the edge and uh, learn how to verify facts first. Okay, don't act on your emotions and don't act on your impulse. It's just going to get you into trouble. Okay. So let's take a look at your month of March.
you know, be very careful in having sex with someone else that you don't know fully, personally, and directly, especially if you don't know if they are clean. Because some singles will have... Um, some singles will have a venereal disease. Okay, so be very careful. You might as well just get yourself tested. Although it's not really going to come out right away after having sex. Sometimes it takes three months, okay, for it to come out. Now let's take a look at your month of March. Now for the month of March, here's, you know, the fire sign that you've been like a trying to escape from or trying to avoid, it will still be knocking on your way. It will still be knocking on your door. Sorry, it will be coming your way. It will be coming across you. Even though this person lives far from you, I feel like they are still going to try and come near you or move near you. It's time for you to put your foot down or to give this person a closure, okay? Once and for all, whatever it is that they were trying to go after you. I also feel like there's some sort of finances that's included or involved or there are some things that you need to put on as a closure. Now, meanwhile, when it comes to your, you know, when it comes to your workplace, hmm, It seems like there is someone who will be, you know, uh, who will be acting close to you or who will try to get close to you or who will try to work on getting close to you, okay? Either way. And for men, I feel like this is going to be like a temptation. And for women, it seems like, I feel like this is, um, well, this person is single and they've been hiding their, you know, their admiration from you for a long period of time and they're going to try and express it this month because there is an event that the two of you will be going and the two of you will be representing the company okay or there will be a journey that the two of you will be going together and that is how things will be developing for singles it's good for those who's already married or already in a relationship there will be a trouble in the paradise okay well can't really blame it because uh, if you're ghost, you're going to be very attractive for an affair, okay, for an uh, for a an unhealthy connection or an unhealthy relationship this month or this year. Um. Now, now when it comes to your love life, a water sign that will be walking out of your life or walking away from you and definitely there will be a termination of connection or there will be a um like an end of a situation okay even though you'll be asking for some forgiveness or this person will be asking for some forgiveness both of you will be very walled up and uh, acting in your defense now you will be concentrating much in your career growth and um, honing more of yourself your skills and uh, solidifying your future and as much as you don't want to entertain this fire sign, this person will definitely be the first person that you're going to be running into right after all the problems that will be happening in your personal life. There is a heartbreak and there will be a temptation that will be starting. Now, sex life, it seems like you are being ogled or, you, you know, someone will be, um, you know, be careful at work for being sexually harassed, whether you're a man or a woman. Because uh, I feel like somebody will be acting a little bit uh, perverted, okay, towards you. And um, you will be longing for the company of that person who just walked away from you. Or you will be longing for your younger days or during those times when you were still young and uh, fresh, you know, in a relationship. So you will be recalling those days and you will wish for things to be the same again. But most of the time you will be doing it yourself. Now when it comes to your health... Bronchial problems, lung problems, or lung issues, especially if you've been smoking, you need to get some sleep or catch up with your relaxation because you're too stressed out and you will, ha you will have frequent palpitations and, you know, rapidness in your heartbeat. You also need to slim down a bit or trim down a bit and you're going to be gaining weight because you're going to be food binging, okay? Aside from that, you will have frequent... um 
migraines or frequent headaches and sensitivity to light plus sensitivity to smell and you need to be a little bit more hygienic with the things that you will be eating drinking and consuming okay let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way this month of march for you Mm. Singles, why is it that life is not going to be very good and friendly to you, you know, for the first quarter of this year? This is only the month of March, yet there will be a lot of agonies and stress that you're going to be going through. You know what? It's actually up to you if you're going to be wallowing over those things and dramas that you're currently going through for the past, sorry, and that you've been going through for the past um five to six months already okay you need to save up more and you need to be a little bit more conservative with your spending or with your budgeting and uh, well i don't feel like you're going to be struggling but um, it seems like it is much better for you to go and save up more money so that you can you know uh you can enjoy your money later on around the third quarter of this year there is a water sign that will be traveling with you or who wants to come and see you okay this is somebody from the past and i feel like there will be some forgiveness or there will be some reconnection that's going to be happening right before you travel because you want to go for some soul searching and you want to go for some travel by yourself even though you're going to have a hard time um making a decision whether you should accept this person or not but the toxicity and the uh, the stress okay it will be too much for you to bear so you will just decide to go off and take your own journey alone it is also much better for you to go and reflect first you know with what's been with what is really going on in your life rather than just complicate it more and more and more every time this person wants to come back into your life and then they're just going to go whenever they wish so let's take a look at your april forecast Okay, now All right by the way, the uh, the Terrascope Forecast Annual, you know, the other version, it's already ready in my website. You can enjoy it. Sorry. You can go and check it out now. Also for the uh, Chinese forecast, okay, for the year of the pig. 
it's already out there now. I'm not really sure if I can still do the uh, the year of the pig forecast, but I will try. But I cannot really promise, okay? Because it's really time consuming, and uh, we are currently working on a new platform for the Destiny Psychics and for the uh, the membership website. Okay, I'm supposed to deliver that last year, but I've been so busy. Okay, and uh, I've been really preoccupied. Plus, I've been traveling a lot and. It's a good thing, you know, the only thing that I'm very, very thankful for, you know, for 2018 is that my health has been very good, okay? And um, it's been really a very, um, even though it's very difficult for the first two quarters, of the, sorry, first and second quarters of uh, last year, even though it's been very uh, hectic and uh, it's like you don't know what's next, okay? But then... The third quarter of the year, it's been very blessed and it's been very, very good. And I, um, you know, every year, every um, anniversary of my company or of my website, I usually give out something more likely a promotion or more of um, what do you call this? More of a uh, freebie. So even though it's already late, you know. Uh, the anniversary of Angels and Limerence is around December, so I'm still thinking of doing something for the Chinese New Year, okay, which will be on February 5th for the Year of the Pig. All right. All right, now for the month of May, wow, well, it looks good, and it seems like your boss will be very impressed with your performance, with your contribution to the company, and in fact, that there will be another celebration that they're going to be raising glass for, and you are the one who's going to be at the center of it. There will be a change of situation, or there will be some good karmas, you know, that will be happening and coming your way, but you're still going to be bothered and bugged by this person who's who, who always lives far from you, or who is already far from you. It seems like either you're in a long-distance relationship, or you just broke up, and you're still thinking about this person, that how you wish that you can offer the success to that person person whether it's a he or she and you are waiting for the right moment to come to get in touch or to at least it seems like their birthday is upcoming or their more likely your anniversary is also upcoming but there is a personal celebration that you are thinking to surprise them but you need to do some rain check because you are the one who might get surprised now when it comes to your workplace if you have had some difficult years for the past two years or for the past few months especially for the last 2018 this month or this is the start of your new beginning of your success and of your um you know of your um mm, well being recognized and being you know, being called out for your inputs, for your, you know, just accept, just accept it, even though it's not your work or even though it's not all of your scope. If someone wants to ask for your idea, especially if it's a, uh, you know, from the higher management, just go for it and try to give out your best. Don't try to make any promises, but try to do your best, okay? Because they want to see something in you because you are already being recommended for somebody who wants to retire in 2020 okay you need to do your best and you, need, you need to be at your best okay now when it comes to your love life uh it seems like you're going to be starting something with this fire sign so th this is more likely a rebound okay the, the water sign just left and now you are thinking or considering a brand new beginning with this fire sign, thinking that you are the one who might be really meant to be together, okay? Now, you will, you know, for those Virgos who's already thinking of getting a divorce or who already got their divorce already, this is not really the right month or the right year for you to consider getting married again. Otherwise, you're just going to get stuck in strings and series of karmas okay when it comes to relationships you need to enjoy yourself and you need to be happy on your own for a little while 
Now, when it comes to your sex life, you need to be a little bit more creative. You're also going to be rejecting someone who wants to be with you, who wants to touch you. And I feel like you are going to be, you're going to have a different fetish, okay, this month or starting this month. Because it seems like the more uh, odd it is, which I can't really specify, but you want to do it outside, okay? Or the more exciting it is, the more you will crave for it, okay? When it comes to your health, high blood pressure, chest pain, heartburn, indigestion, lung issues, um, feeling nauseous, especially when you're in a higher place, and be very careful in falling, um, skin irritations and skin allergies, um, skin asthma, having some problems, um, oh, you're going to be, you also need to, um, change your reading glasses because you're going to know that you are um, farsighted okay and some virgos will also find out that they are pregnant or they're going to be giving birth during this month okay with a healthy baby mostly will be it will be a boy uh, sorry baby boy okay and you also need to detoxify and distress and take a vacation near the water let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way All right, for the month of May, let's take a look. Oh, the month of May looks good. Hopefully down to the end of the month. Wow, looking good. It looks like somebody from the past will be re-emerging or is coming to you. Hopefully you heed my advice last month, you know, or for the month of April because there's somebody from the past that will be coming back into your life. And if you already rebounded with the fire sign, then it will become more of a complicated situation or problem because you still have a lot of feelings for this other person who's going to be coming back into your life okay so i don't feel like the fire sign is something that you can just cut off just like that well they are not yet done done getting whatever they want from you so you will have a hard time discarding them Well, domination. Someone wants to dominate you in a relationship. It seems like 
uh, things will be doing good and okay during this month, but then there will be some more complications. And someone will also be seducing you, okay, to give in to their temptation. So be very careful. All right. Month of May. Looks like it's going to be very, very good, Virgo. Okay, you will be signing up a new contract. If you're opting for a new home loan, car loan, or just any bank loan, it will be given to you and it will be granted, you know, to you this month. And somebody from the past whom you really have a lot of feelings for, and this is the one that you're really, you know, that is your real soulmate or twin flame will be coming back into your life and you know it's like they just took their time okay to clear things off and to clear their head to clear their emotions so that when they approach you they're no longer going to be upset but right before that happens it seems like there will be some more complications that you have to sort out as i've said don't rebound because it's not yet over over and this is not really the right year for you to start a new um a new uh, relationship with someone new or even if it's from the past because you know the fire sign is from the past and then the uh, the water sign just get jealous and they just cut you off they walked away and then now they came back and then you'll they're they're gonna find out that you're already with somebody else so you know uh you have to make a choice and then you have to uh you have to sit down and talk which is you will be, but you are going to be feeling stuck like, who am I going to be choosing? Because you're afraid that what if you're going to choose and forgive this water sign and they're just going to walk away when they cannot really handle the situation while this fire sign is trying to do their best. But you know what I can tell you? This fire sign, they're not going to be staying faithful and loyal. The love bombing, it's not really going to stay that way and it's not really going to last, okay? Right after getting what they want from you and right after reestablishing themselves, they're just going to walk away and look for another change or look for another change challenge okay so you need to be more careful with your decision when it comes to your workplace there is a recognition award or like a mm, more likely a um, like an employee of the year kind of thing or employee of the month or there is like a like an award okay that you're going to be winning and there are some people which is more likely a an air sign in a water sign sorry yeah an air sign in a water sign that you know remember in one of those ones that i told you someone is going to be trying to get close to you and act like your friend now these two are not actually your friends they are trying to penetrate and to manipulate you so that you know, they're going to be running or they're going to be competing for the cup or for the trophy while they are trying to mold your head. Okay, but they, this is something that they did not really expect that you will have this much luck when it comes to your when it comes to your work or when it comes to being competitive. So they're going to be hating you. So watch your back. Okay, it's not yet. Um, it's not yet the end or this is not yet the, the end of the game for this too. Um. I feel like they're both women because they're going to be acting both bitchy towards you right after that. Um, if it's a guy, I don't really feel like it's a guy. But anyway, you know, it could be anyone. Anyway, um, and you will be harvesting the fruits of your labor. Your company will also be giving you a uh, like a one week off, you know, or one week paid holiday. And you will be visiting a friend from a big city and you will also be treating yourself, you know, into a spa or, you know, or you'll be, you're going to be pampering yourself for a week and uh, you really disturb this so much. But then your love life or your personal life will still be at the top of your head or will still be at the top of your worries. Even though you will try to go out with someone, you will still be thinking about this water sign. Now... You thought that this, you know, this relationship is already over and all of a sudden this person will just come knocking at your door again 
and will try to you know make things work but then this person just walked away from you right you know right at the time when you needed them so much and then right now when you're doing okay and in fact your your career has been doing good ever since they you know ever since they took off and now they're going to come back again just because the things are doing good in your life and they want to have a slice of it okay so you need to weigh down your option okay which one do you really want to stay with which one can really make you happy and can make you secured okay sex life you will be rejecting someone who will try to seduce you or who will try to put you oh and one more thing be very careful about this because this person who's going to be uh, seducing you that is re related to your work it is related to someone who's been trying to set you up okay be very careful about this because this it's not what you think it is it's not like an attractive thing or it's not like they are so really into you okay this is a setup and also you're gonna be feeling a little bit more wild okay and there will be a lot more oral that you're gonna be demanding to your partner you're gonna be demanding to your sexual partner during this month and you're gonna be more into it now you also need to catch up more to your sleep especially when it comes to your you know especially when it comes to your health because you've been under a lot of stress as i've said that you're going to be you know your company will be giving you some break or paid holidays and it's really time for you to make the most out of it okay you need to enjoy you need to relax but just try to stay away from it's like you're going to be forcing your eyes in reading or working you know in a place where it's dark I mean, it's not so dark, but there's just like an ample, you know, illumination or uh, like a, a shade of light, but uh, it's not enough, okay? And you will be careful with food poisoning. And um, I feel like you're going to be getting in touch with some of the, uh, with some of your relatives or old friends, and you're going on a vacation in a uh, Latin country. Okay, for a week. Now let's take a look, singles, what's going to be coming your way this month of May, right before we read your month of June. All right. All right, this month of May, you will be, it's like you're going to be facing your boss, okay, about a particular position or a position, that, sorry, <laughs> about a particular promotion or pro, uh, position that you want to have, and you will be granted, you know, uh, but you have to expect that there is someone else who also wants the same kind of offer, or who also wants the same kind of promotion or position or opportunity. Even though it's uh, you will be the first priority of your boss or of your your management, don't be so confident. Okay. Now somebody from the past who is an air sign will also be, air sign and fire sign will be coming back into your life. There will be some reconnection and some communications that's going to be happening, and it seems like you're going to be um, <clears throat> swinging back and forth between the two of them. Okay. 
but I feel like you will be ending this connection with the fire sign as soon as possible or as soon as you know that their intention is not really clean and they are also not clean now you will be visiting some family members and you will try to mend your heartache or heartbreak by making some changes into your home environment or by relocation now let's take a look at your month of June I actually have to push the cards all the way up so that you know all of the five decks will be you know will fit into this space so you must all be wondering why do I have to keep on pushing the cards and then I have to rearrange it again so all right Okay. Hmm. Oh, it looks like you're going to be choosing this fire sign. And uh, one more thing, yeah, because uh, somebody actually, uh, I forgot her name, but I already answered her to the comment section. Um, yeah, I, you know, as much as I want to um, work on uploading mo uh, you know, more videos, I wish I have enough time, you know, because um, I still have to do the live calls, I need to do the recording, and then I need to do the uh, updating of the website and everything else, so... And then I still have to do some other personal stuff on the side. So, you know, I'm going to try. I can't, I'm not saying that I can't and I won't. But I'm going to try, okay? So, no promises. And hopefully this 2019, I'll be able to upload more um, general forecasts, okay? And by the way, if you want to have your own annual personal forecast, just go and visit me at my website, or you may just email me directly, okay, to inquire. All right. All right, now... Hmm... Okay, this month of June looks like your career will still be very, you know, very good and it will have a lot of activities, 
there will be more progress. Um, the things that you've been wishing for the past few years, it is finally going to be taking place. You will also be traveling by the end of this month, and you will also be, you know, you will manage to see a family member that you haven't seen for a long period of time. And um, I feel like uh, someone around you is also pregnant that you will learn, someone who's younger than you and is an earth sign. Okay, and uh, it seems like someone will also be inviting you to their wedding, and you're gonna be very um, surprised that people around you are moving on. Okay, now when it comes to your workplace, you will have a lot of stress. It seems like none of the things that you kind of organized in the past are you, you know, working in the uh, working on schedule or working on your own schedule. Or it's not really working as planned. So there will be some delays, some blockages, some people that's missing, some things that's missing, wreckage of a vehicle or cancellation of flights. And there will be a lot of things that you feel like, why is it that it's happening right now? You know, but still, you're going to be the winner. You're going to be able to deliver what you know, because you're supposed to travel and, uh, you know, do some presentations or do some work, you know, in the in your client's company or you are going to a client's company or office or whatever it is outside the city and you need to do your best you need to be at your best but then up to the last minute you will be tested okay but don't worry because the, all of you will be celebrating that you're gonna make it through okay and this is how your bonds will be forming and will get even more strengthened even though most of you don't really get along well with each other and most of you don't do not really like each other but when it comes to your work when it comes to your work delivery you have one aim okay so this is the good thing and this is also the great teamwork now when it comes to your love life somebody from the past which is a fire sign that you're going to be choosing to be with because you feel like this is the one who is more of a family person more committing and will be showing you that they're really changing. But the thing here is right at the middle of the month, right before it happens, and right after you're making a choice and showing you that sorry, showing that person that you are their that they are your choice, they're gonna be showing their true colors. Now, as I've said, that this person they're only gonna be love bombing you at the beginning, and then later on they're just gonna be showing off their they're real callers when the you know when the when the excitement is over when the thrill is over they're going to be looking for another you know party to enjoy and to get involved with so this is the time where you will start thinking that i already made the right choice of choosing this person now sex life it seems like you're gonna be um well, there will be some role playings, and uh, it will be very active during this month. But the, you know, for women, you're gonna have a hard time. Um, what do you call this? Like um, stimulating your partner or getting it up. Okay, it is gonna bore you, and it is gonna make you feel more insecure or make you feel insulted because. You're always sweating all over, and yet it's not yet, you know, rising. So you're going to have a hard time dealing with this uh, whole thing with your partner, not to mention that they're also very egocentric, or they are, you know, it's going to hurt their ego, of course, who's not. So there will be some arguments that will be arising because of this or after this. Skin allergies and... Um, some nasal problems and uh, that is related to your ear and i feel like you are going to be a little bit preoccupied and daydreaming most of the time uh your vacation near the water will almost be over or it will be over or uh, it's already over during this month and i feel like some virgo women will be giving birth during this month or you're going to find out that you are pregnant, okay? So this is more of a very fertile month for you. Aside from that, only your stress and your, your depression and emotional trauma that you have to deal with. Let's take a look, singles, what's going to be coming your way right before you read your month of July. <clears throat> My throat is a little bit itchy and uh, 
it's hurting a little bit because this is the third time that I um, re-recorded this video because when I cut off the um, you know the other video that I have recorded I'm almost halfway through the uh, the year and then I just discovered there's no sound so I had to redo it again it is annoying but I have to you know all right All right. Mm. Looks like you're going to be finding a new lover this month. And you're going to be very into this person. And you will somehow feel like you're a perfect match. You finally found someone who is more likely like you. Or you're going to be mirroring each other. You're going to have the same chemistry. You're going to be very happy finishing each other's sentences. And it's like you are just you know really meant to be so this is the start of a brand new um brand new beginning brand new life and brand new happiness and if no just don't move in right away and um try to get to know this person more before letting them into your private place or before letting them into your place okay and be very careful in getting pregnant or you know having an unprotected sex because this is the time where you're going to be very, very fertile. When it comes to your workplace, it seems like you are impressing your boss. A lot of your peers and a lot of your um, colleagues right now are also very pleased with your performance and contribution. Sorry, contribution. And you are also going to be um, expressing more of your intent or expressing more of your contribution and creativity. Um, working with a team and volunteering as well which is your you know your managers will be liking it yeah good for you it seems like you're changing and growing all right let's take a look at your july month or your july forecast Oh, by the way, you can also um, watch my videos at the uh, Daily Horoscope app, you know. You can actually find the, uh, the download link at the uh, description box below. Oh. Seems like month of July for you will be very complicated. Oh, not really. Ah, falling in love.
<laughs> wow. It seems like right after um, separating from the water sign, you're really taking this fire sign for real. And seriously. You're going to get hooked up with some taboo. Um, you know, styles. I'm not saying that you're going to be getting involved with but more likely either you're going to be reading about it or watching it. You know, just to stimulate you. And you're also going to be discovering a lot more about yourself on what can really turn you on. Okay? And so is your partner. And you are also going to be teaching each other how to do this and that. And um, active sex life. Okay? Which is you're going to have a lot this month. Now, month of July, somebody from, well, Somebody will be coming from a long, long way, okay, just to come and see you. And right after making that decision, it seems like this person has already made the decision, which is a fire sign. Changes are coming and more communications, correspondence that will be flying your way. You just need to weigh down your options and balance your time, you know. Plus, lumps of money and um, it seems like you're going to be going for some shopping, you know, or for some little bit of... Uh, well, changing your clothes and changing your stuff. I also feel like if you want to get a new car, this is a great month for you to do that. And you're also going to be loving to... You're also going to love to show off to your family or to showcase them what you have achieved so far. But be very careful in too much bragging. Now, when it comes to your workplace... It seems like you need to add up a little bit more of your magic and charm. And I feel like you just need to be a little bit more tolerating when there are some people or when there are some of your team who's not really doing their work. There will be an argument that will be breaking out between you and another co-worker or another teammate or somebody who's working for you or you know under you and this person will be a little bit vindictive okay uh, there are two people who's working under you or who is under your supervision it will be brainwashed by this water and air sign so you need to be very careful you just need to learn how to balance and find your center and try to come up with a solution that won't be really you know harsh or violent but you need to put your foot down. Now, and then when it comes to your love life, it seems like this air sign or somebody that you've already cut off will still keep be keep a, sorry, will still be trying to keep in touch with you. And it seems like there's a part of you who feels like you should have, okay, or you could have. But then there are some other resentments, you know, on the side, but then you're just trying to be strong on how to make a stand and how to be firm with your decision being with this fire sign. Which is hopefully you're not really wrong with your decision. Now, this sex life. Hmm. The sex life, it, it looks like you're going to be cutting across your, um, you know, Cutting across your uh, your your standards, and it seems like either you or your partner is gaining some weight, and you will be laughing it off during the time that you're making love or that you're having sex. But it seems like the joke will become true. Okay, or it's more likely that uh, they are just trying to. You know, to do it in a joking way, but what they meant is really true. So, you know, there will be some things that you're not going to be agreeing upon. But still, you know, your sex life will still be very active and still humping right, like a rabbit. Um, Oral playing is also there. And uh, when it comes to your health, gaining weight, you need to detoxify and try to meditate to control your anger and your stress feeling a little bit more sensitive to high places food binging you need to catch up on your sleep because you won't be really sleeping because your mind won't stop 
working and thinking. Some Virgos will also be giving birth or will find out that they are pregnant during this month or that they don't want the baby. So be very careful about your decision, okay? It's a gift. So, and then you will have a hard time. Um, you know, try to lessen the uh, intake of fatty food, okay, and carbohydrates because you will be panting you will be like like shortness of breath you know you'll be experiencing that palpitation sleep apnea and you know horrible snoring as well uh you're going to be going through that plus swelling of your feet and knees and you will have some unexplainable itchiness you know in your skin and i feel like you need to um change your clothing or you need to refit or you, you know not really refit but uh more of a repair just need to try your your clothes again if it's still fitting you or if it's still uh, suitable for your body because as i've said that you will be gaining weight or that you are gaining weight mm. or more likely it is because that you're also pregnant you know Let's take a look. All right. Hmm, drinking out of your depression. Some single Virgos will be drinking their emotions again. Uh, it seems like this person that you thought is really the right one for you, you will be discovering that this person is lying and is... You know, there it's like you will be raising a lot of questions, like what is their intention? Why is it that I can call you at this on all time? Why is it that you're not texting me? Why is it that you're like this, you're like that? You know, there will be a lot of questions, and then this person will just get too sensitive and will be, you know, lashing at you. So there will be a lot of arguments. Of course, you're not stupid, and you will know that this person is hiding something from you. And uh, try to spend more time with your friends okay i feel like you're going to be going out more often this month and um well your work will be much more established and uh, i don't see any problems or i don't see any issues with your works or finances except that it's going to be stable and it will still be remaining the same i don't see any travel i don't see any problems with your health except that you will be drinking too much more than your limit it seems like you're going to be more of an alcoholic this year and you need to be a little bit more careful with the things that you're going to say, especially being so impulsive, emotional, or saying something while you are drunk. Otherwise, you're just going to end up in something legal. All right, let's take a look at your August forecast. Okay. Now we're down to your August forecast, our month of August. Mm. 
Mm -mm. Heartbreak right in the middle of the month. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, things are not really looking good. Okay, mm, looks like there will be some problems and there will be a lot of emotional arguments. Okay, especially when it comes to your relationships. You will have a lot of resentments, okay? Um, you will be walking away or taking a vacation or taking some time off from a relationship. And it seems like you are going to be making a... Um, like an out-of-town trip. I don't feel like it's going to be a very long trip, okay? Or it's going to be like a, uh, like a very long vacation. Could be or just around the weekends. Just for you to have a little breather and just for you to have a space, you know, to think about things and to make a decision whether is it, you know, is it really time to walk away? But I feel like right in the middle of the month, you are definitely going to be making a decision and you're going to be walking away. Right after that, you're going to be calling for an emergency holiday or emergency vacation. And you're going to be taking your work with you. While you are tendering your wounds and while you are trying to relieve your stress, okay, you will try to, you know, to attend some parties and you will try to distract yourself. But you need to be very careful because the person that you are trusting, especially if you have an assistant or somebody that you entrust those very essential paperwork or documents. It seems like this person cannot also be trusted. Okay, so be very careful about that. Otherwise, you will just end up uh, fixing things yourself. And then by the end of the month, there are three people that will be resigning all of a sudden. Okay, out of nowhere and out of the blue, you're not yet aware of the uh, you know of the uh, the reason. But then around by the end of the year, you will know. Why did they left all of a sudden? Okay. Still, you will be going through this and you will be overcoming this obstacle and you'll be overcoming this, you know, this whole drama and scenario. But I feel like they will get, you know, the reason why they are, they are forced to resign is because they were caught stealing, you know, from the company or they were caught bre breaching into someone else's computer, which is they are not really allowed to. Now, when it comes to your romantic life, this fire sign will be, 
you know, it's like they're going to try and convince you that, you know, we're already here. Why are you, you know, moving away? Why are you like this? Why are you like that? And it seems like, um, it seems like you are going to be, you know, um, It seems like you're going to be a little bit more, not really insecure, but more of thinking twice. That this person, this fire sign is not really what they claim to be. Okay, it's like they are, they have dual personalities and they are too bipolar. They're going to be saying a lot of harsh things and then the next thing you knew is that they are already wooing you. And you don't really need this kind of a relationship, okay? And there will be more fights and arguments by the end of the month. That will be affecting your sex life and this person will try to woo you but then this person is also a little bit perverted okay uh this person will be asking you to record your you know your thing while you're doing it don't allow it to happen because uh, you know by the end of this month or by the end of this year they will just use that to blackmail you so don't uh, allow them and when it comes to your yeah, and obviously some of you will say, who would, you know, who would allow that to happen? But, you know, when you're in love and when you trust that person fully, you're going to agree on it. That's why I'm already trying to advise you and remind you not to. Now, when it comes to your health, gaining weight, also be careful with your kidney stones or be careful with too much of salty food, okay? Um, again, still some skin problems some skin irritations that you don't even know what to do with that anymore you've been dealing with this sorry with the, you've been dealing with this allergy for almost half a year now and still you haven't really come up with a better solution or with it better um you know it's like it's getting worse you know the more you apply cream the more it gets worse which is i feel like it's time for you to go and uh, consult someone who's not a more like a faith healer Okay, because I feel like someone is just very envious of your nice skin and they are just doing something to you. Now, you also, and your eye bags are growing big because you're not really sleeping. You need to catch up on your sleep and you need to catch up with your relaxation. Okay, you also need to release your negative energies, which has been weighing you down, and be careful with wild animals if you're going to go out on a run or walk outside let's take a look singles All right, now, mm, looks like there will be a winning moment for you, and you're going to be very, very happy. When it comes to your career, it seems like there is something like a contract that you're going to be winning, and sorry, an agreement that you're going to be signing, and that you will be getting your bonus or commission, plus an opportunity for you to go abroad or for you to go internationally to represent the company or to attend a very special conference or exhibition or expo. 
and i feel like this is the time where you will be celebrating much and you will also be going with two more people so you're not going to be alone when it comes to your love life you don't really want to pay attention much from this because all you ever got is a drama okay and as much as you want to fall in love and to be loved again all you ever got is hurt and pain and slicing okay and wounds okay it's like the love that you keep on getting or, or, or the, the, the people that you keep on meeting are too toxic for you. But when it comes to your work and, you know, when it comes to your works and finances, everything will be doing good. Everything will be fine and there will be more financial stability. I also feel like you will hear about an ex who will be having their baby soon. And it's just going to cut you through or will be like putting your hopes down. Let's take a look at your September forecast. You know, Virgo, I don't really see a new person coming your way or coming in your life this year, except that it's always, you know, it's all from the past. And those are the people who already made you cry in the past. And those are the people who just kept you hanging, gave you some false promises, and then leave you somewhere in the middle. You will be exchanging communications with somebody while you're trying to sort out your trouble with your current partner. All right, now, this month of September for you looks like, mm -hmm. it looks like you are turning your back on everyone, oh, except for your work, of course, but um, it seems like you don't really want to talk to anybody, you don't want to... It's like, you know, even though with this person that you're with, you don't want to talk things out anymore. Because all you, you know, it's like all you ever hear from this person are just purely bullshit. And uh, it's just all crap. And you don't want to believe in any of those false promises anymore. 
Now, you will be working towards your self-fulfillment and healing. And you're still thinking about this person from the past, which is eventually the two of you will be meeting, you know, somewhere in the middle and this person will know and feel that you're thinking about them. So there will be some communications, okay? Now, when it comes to your work, it seems like you are going to be overworking too hard to the extent that you almost live in your office. And um, I, not to mention that you will also be spending a lot more time with your friends and with your co-workers. And then you're going to go back to your office because you don't want to go home and be reminded of the things that you don't want to be reminded of. You will also be um, exchanging correspondence or email with somebody from the past whom you still have some hang-ups with. Now, when it comes to your love life, you know that this is not really the right time to get married or to settle down or to at least go for a serious commitment. And you were so blinded by your rage and your, uh, you know, your weakness in the past. But now you've already realized that what you really need right now is just yourself and nobody else. Okay, even though you still have a lot of feelings for this other water sign person, you're, you're very satisfied sexually with the fire sign person. But then altogether... Both of them just tear your heart apart and they are not really, you know, enough to make a stand for you or not really strong enough to be with you. Now, when it comes to your sex life, it seems like you're going to be into some brutal or some wild or, uh, you know, some scratching and biting and hopefully not slicing uh, kind of a sex. And... Um, I feel like you are going to be sneaking behind the back room or behind, the, you know, the bathroom with someone. And, uh, well, you're just pretty much going to be into it. You will be meeting somebody that is younger than you, that will make you happy, and that will also drive your, you know, your, your libido, okay, or your, uh, your passion, but then it's this is just more like this physical connection, nothing more. I don't see any problem with your health during at this point, except that you just need to keep on exercising. Be careful in wild animals and do not create your own medications. Might as well just consult with a doctor or with an herbalist. And you will start thinking about going back to the water again. And you also need to um it's like there's like a cleansing or something that you need to do when it comes to your lungs is already being infected right now because of too much smoking or secondhand smoking let's take a look at your september forecast for singles All right. Oh, good. Oh, finally singles. I finally see good spread for you. Well, somebody from the past was an ear sign will be coming back into your life and you will be traveling or you're going to be considering this person. But uh, last month you just said that, you know, you don't want to consider anything about love and relationship, and here you are again. You never learn. Um, happiness will be in store for you when it comes to your work, and there will be some change of situation. You will also be on trial for a position, a higher position that will be 
you know, vacated by someone who will be resigning or retiring soon. You will be recommended for this, so you need to do your best and you need to be at your best. An air sign person that will be coming back into your life and who will be corresponding or communicating back with you, which will be, you know, it will start from a small inquiry and then this person will be, you know, talking their way up and then they're just going to try and see if you're still available or not. And then when they find out that you're available, then they're going to be like, you know, coaching you again or they will be, um, what do you call this, wooing you again, okay? And I feel like someone at your work will be driving you like a slave, okay? So, well, they just want to, you know, to see your best so so that you will fit with this new position. So don't just try to do your best. As I've said, that you will almost be living in your office because of the late night works and then you will always be there. And try to avoid this uh, fire sign person again. You know, even for singles, the fire sign just keeps on coming out to you. So, the air sign, I feel like they're too proud to commit. Although they are, you know, they are going to be showing you that they have realized a lot of wrong things. And that they really love you. But still, proceed with caution. Let's take a look at your October forecast. Okay, let's take a look at your August for sorry, October forecast. Hmm, October will be very good for you. Except, uh, what is that month for the, oh, okay, September, I think. And July. Well, at least that there are two bad months for you. In a year. Having some, you will be experiencing some problems at work. Whew. Wow, that is quite a revelation. This fire sign that you're with, it seems like you are going to be discovering that they have a child, okay, from two different women, aside from the child that you already know, okay? So, that is your cue. Okay. Now, right after this, I will be drawing your oracle cards, but this time I'll be using the 
guardian angel tarot cards because they have more messages okay and they are more concise and more you know specific and more helpful as well okay emotionally i feel like you are slowly coming out from the storm okay from the emotional storm that you just uh, recently got yourself into but it seems like you will be protecting yourself from this water sign that you are continuously communicating with it seems like you just want to wait for the right time until you're fully ready or until this person has fully grown or matured and is you know will also be ready to understand whatever it is that you're going through because your career and your finances have been doing well so you don't want to mess it all up just because of this you know love life that you're still thinking but you know what it's why don't you just enjoy your life being single for now because you're you know uh, i mean you're very established you're independent and uh, you're the one who's actually being um depended on not the one who's been depending on someone so you know you don't really need somebody who will just give you a lot of headaches and heartaches and uh you know uh, will be consuming your time and attention as well now when it comes to your when it comes to your work there will be some problems and there will be some stress there will be some breakouts and there will be some information that will also be leaking which is, I feel like this is related to the three people that, that you know, that resigned out of the blue in one of the months that I have, you know, read. And I feel like one of the information that will be leaking will be about your boss and then about you. And then some of the email correspondences, which is you will, all of you will be able to track it down and you will nail down who are the culprits and you will be able to stop it right before it reaches, you know, those destined people it's more likely an inside job as well but you'll be able to make it through and work on it you're smart so now when it comes to your when it comes to your love life it is really messy full of dramas revelations walking away resentments blaming games bantering and bickering and the bitter truth that this person or this fire sign they did not you know they did not told you that they still have some other children from the uh from the previous relationships that they've been in and the reason why this person escaped or just to you know run forth to you is because they are trying to escape a responsibility from somebody that they just had a baby with see now when it comes to your sex life you are you're still going to be having a lot more of it and in fact that you're not really going to get tired doing it but then it seems like you just want to do it for the sake of you know you don't want to be alone or you just want to feel because I don't really feel like you're going to be really pleasured during this month. But it seems like there's only something that you want to get out from it. Okay. Now. And you will be having sex with someone who's very plump. Um, especially for men. Now, when it comes to your health, asthma and... Um, your animal pet will also get sick, so whatever that they're going to be having, it will also it can be passed on to you. Okay, so be very careful about that, um, especially having some fever, or if you if you will notice that their nose is dripping. Your immune system also needs to you know you you need to pay attention to your immune system. You also need to catch up more in your sleep and relaxation. You're not really sleeping. You're too over. You're overworking and abusing yourself too much. And again, the indigestion plus the reason why you're having all this and then bloatedness is because you're not really eating up on time. Okay. 
and it's also time for you to go to the doctor okay and check out what's really wrong with your body because there are a lot of things that you're feeling but you're not paying attention to your health because you're too busy to pay attention to your um body or health let's take a look singles what's going to be coming your way this month of october right before we read your month of november finally Don't argue with your boss. Now, somebody from the past, uh, okay. Now, for singles, this fire sign that will be coming back into your life, it seems like they're really going to be charming you again into whatever it is that they want from you. And then they will be promising you marriage. But then, right before the middle of the month comes, there will be another breakup. Now, uh, there will also be some change to your well change in the horizon and then um it seems like there is an unexpected job offer that will be coming your way and you have to tiptoe you know right behind your boss because it it, it looks like this correspondence will be coming across them and there will be some arguments okay and there will be some confrontation so be very careful um you're not yet sure if this offer is going to come for real or if it's if, or if this is just a test and again you're going to be drinking again okay be careful with your alcoholism all right and this might just cause you your health because you're drinking too heavily and you're not really taking care of your health not so much that you're not really eating much and you are not taking care of your body. Travel is also on the horizon for you. Let's take a look at your November forecast. Looks like you're going to be stuck with this fire sign all year long. Because <laughs> it seems like no matter how much you try to push this person away, They're still going to be in your life.
Okay, then it looks like this is the sign that you've been waiting for and asking for. Huh. A big betrayal by a fire sign. All right. Okay. Hmm. Month of November for you will be an average month. I mean, not in terms of finances. Your finances will be average and okay. I don't see any problem. Except that when it comes to your love life, it seems like there will be a lot of chaotic and tumultuous moments that you have to go through. Not to mention that there will be a lot of surprising revelations that you will be discovering from this fireside person. You see, this is actually the, um, you know, the bad side of being successful when, you know, in your career. It seems like, you know, when it comes to your career, there's no question about it. You know, it's going to be more stable. You're, con you're continuously going to go up. And I feel like you're going to be, um, you know, you will continuously progress and grow. And you will also be motivating a lot of people. But. This is, you know, what I'm actually afraid of. Let's skip the uh, the work first because, you know, your work is already doing okay. Except that the only thing that you're, you know, the, re the reason why you're going to be feeling melancholic when it comes to your work and stressed out is because, you know, of your personal life. But when it comes to your workplace, everything else will be very, you know, everything else will be very established and will be doing good and okay. And people will be... And the usual that you're going to be very busy, you know, and then, you know, you will always be in demand, especially with the high position that you're going to be holding during at this point as well. So obviously your responsibilities will be very broad and, uh, you know, <clears throat> now. Um, love life. This is the main highlight for this month. That you will be discovering a lot of lies. You'll be discovering a lot of truth. And that, you know, the, uh, the you, you know, when you made this decision, your intuition told you to be very careful or not to choose the fire sign. But then you feel like, ah, you know, why not? Because you just want to get back at the water sign when the, you know, when this person just walked away from your life or out of your life. And then you feel like choosing the fire sign would just tear them apart. But now look at you. You know, this month of November is going to be very, 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 very painful for you. I mean, you've been trying to work on your self-healing. You've been trying to try to move on. And you've been trying to work on your... You know, and you're finding your own happiness and life fulfillment. And then here you go. The reason why this thing will be breaking out is because somebody that this person or this fire sign is currently involved with, it's, you know, as well at the same time, will be giving you a call or will be reaching out to you. And that is where the big news or where the big truth will be coming out in the open. Okay. 
uh, you will try to confront this person, but instead of them saying sorry or admitting their mistakes, they are the one who's going to be acting more defensive and will be lashing at you. So, what do you expect? Anyway, when it comes to your sex life, okay, still, I feel like even if you will try to to do it, even if you will try, even if, even if you want it, Okay, it's not really going to work out at this time because either you're going to be dry or you're 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 going to have a hard time getting it up. Okay, because of the stress and because of the emotional problems that you're currently going through. And I feel like when it comes to your health, the stress, you will be feeling like you're about to have a heart attack or you're feeling you will somehow feel that you know you're the right part of your body, your face, your arms, your your legs, and everything else are starting to get numb, and there are some tingling sensation. It's because of your rising blood pressure, and it's because of your stress as well, okay? You will also have some extra sensitivity to light, especially during the morning, that you will find your eyes always teary-eyed, or your, you know, it's like you always have some colds because you keep on, you know, having some tears even though you're not crying or it could be that your soul is crying and migraines and uh, being too preoccupied, always spaced out. You also need to, you know, well, you're going to be um, turning into some green or leafy uh, vegetable diet or salad diet and then you will also try to do some exercise, okay? Also, be careful. Or sorry, take care of your bones and if you're um, take care of your um, what do you call this? Your uh, your breast as well. And you also need to nurture yourself. You're not really paying attention to your health. This is the problem. And you also need to change your reading glasses. Let's take a look, singles. What's going to be coming your way this month of November? All right. <laughs> okay, single Virgos looks like you are also going to be you just want to get back at this um air sign and then you're going to be dumping this person. All right, now you are just going to try and get back at this, you know, air sign person who just gave you a lot of, um, what do you call this, like a lot of, um, you know, heartbreaks and disappointments in the past. And now it's just your time to, you know, to rejoice that finally you're free from this person. But it's, you know, it's an empty victory. I mean, yeah, you get back at this person, but what did you get? You're still hurt in the inside. So I feel like along with that, might as well just give this person a closure, okay? And you will be communicating with somebody from the past, which is a water sign. And I feel like when it comes to your workplace, you will still be the boss and you will still be calling the shots. You know, in fact, that your boss will be letting you handle a very difficult and complicated task so that they can see if you're really fit for the right position or for the next position that will be vacant, which is already higher. 
okay? You're going to be a little bit, you're going to be, you know, uh, you're going to become a little bit ambitious and um, more aggressive on the go. And just be careful not to run into someone else's toes, okay? Uh, I also feel like right after all of these heartbreaks, you will finally be communicating with somebody that is right for you. Let's take a look finally at your December forecast. Leo will be next. Wow. <clears throat> this month of December for you will be very, very lucky. And some Virgos will also be winning something in a raffle draw or in a... Either in a casino or a game of chance, but not in a lottery. But in overall, it seems like you are gonna be having a lot of money during this month. Okay? And there is also... Like a success that's going to be coming your way. And hmm, you're going to be walking away from a relationship. Well, at least that you're going to be, you know. <laughs> Life will be balancing you with some luck and uh, some happiness. And you're going to be dancing for joy. And while you're going to be um, walking away from your, you know, from your relationships. And you will also be um, moving to a new place or a new city altogether. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Now, oh, again, like what I said, that this is going to be a very lucky month for you, and you're also going to be moving to a new house 
or a new city okay in overall there will be some changes in your home environment or to your um to where you're residing it's something that you've been waiting for will finally be coming true and i feel like you will also be attending a wedding of a family member or relative during this month and you will you know you'll definitely be in the center or you're going to be catching a lot of their attention to you because you will be you know it's like uh, a lot of people will be drawn into you despite of the uh, heartbreak you know that you're going through now you will be walking away from a relationship finally and you're not going to be choosing any one of them it's not going to be the water sign it's not going to be the fire sign because you just want to simply have it's like you don't want to settle for anything less okay you want to have a blissful life you want to have a complete harmony without any you know gray areas or you without any secrecies or without any betrayals of some sort because you know it's not just once it's not just twice that this person have betrayed you but it's like a series of betrayals and deceptions and secrets and it's like you know it just really blew in front of your face you know, when it comes to your workplace, there's no problem. And in fact, that you're, you know, you're, you will all be busy with the celebrations and with all the, you know, because it's going to be a very fruitful year for your company. So this month, you're going to be like preparing for more rewards and incentives and bonuses for your people and for, you know, for your subordinates. You're going to be talking with the management. There will be a lot more meetings. There will be long working hours and you will be traveling with your bosses and you will be arranging some of the, uh, you know, some of the uh, gifts for the staff. So it's more of like a rewarding month for you when it comes to your work. And now this is the big thing now when it comes to your relationships this person will still be you know they will still try to justify whatever it is that you did they are going through or what they have done to you and instead of apologizing or instead of saying that oh i'm so sorry that i have kept you i've kept this from you or i did not really tell you that you know i have this i have that that this is the situation before right before i i met you or right before we get back together that this and that this and that this and that so this person will be justifying whatever it is that they have done to you and that is what's going to be like you know um that's what's going to be clicking inside of you that you know it's like you're going to be snapping out of it that this person is not really the right one for you that right after giving your all and right after choosing over the one who is much and way better to be chosen but you chose this person just because that you thought that the they have the uh you know they have the um capability of being in a committed relationship but then it's just all bullshit it's a good thing that you haven't really moved in together yet now sex uh now when it comes to your sex life it looks like you're going to be messing around with someone who's already married or you're going to be messing around with someone who's very, very young. And you're going to be hiding this from a crowd because you are so afraid to be judged. Now, um, it seems like you're going to be enjoying much of your sexual connection. Especially that what this person will be doing to you is something new, although it's going to be painful. And you are already sick and tired of all those, you know, older people or older partners that you've been with and they did not really satisfy you except that they're always craving for their own satisfaction when it comes to your health immune system you know and uh, it seems like you also need to shield your body from any infections or from any uh, swollen ankles and swollen joints you will also have some problems with your varicose and you need to watch what you eat especially if you're into junk food and uh, uh ready to eat food and full of preservatives migraines that is gonna get worse and it seems like you're gonna be feeling more shivery or cold except that you know the season is really cold and you're gonna be dancing along with your um along with your success and happiness so it's going to be a very light and uh, breezy month for you, December. More dramas or heavy dramas, but at least that you're already at the end of it. 
okay that you don't really need to deal more with it you should have just chosen the the water sign instead well at least now you know what's going to be happening next so at least now you know so that you don't really have to go through with those you know dramas and turmoils and the other stuff like that Okay. This entire year, you're much of a big drinker. Uh, be careful with the alcoholism, because it might just, you know. Okay, now you will learn how to forgive, and you will also be dating someone consistently during this time. And because of that, you will also be learning how to communicate well and how to express yourself there will be a celebration and it seems like you are gonna be learning a lot from yourself for the past few months you just need to cut off and curb down your drinking okay um this is not yet <clears throat> it's too early to say if this is the one that you're gonna be ending up with but what's important is that you need to take care of your present so that you can have a future together okay you also need to move away and move on from the past. And uh, you need to forgive those who have already seen you. <clears throat> and those who have already done you wrong in the past. Okay? Don't hold on too much to your grudges. Because it will just weigh you down. Okay? When it comes to your um, finances, it seems like you just need to take care of yourself. Watch your back. Don't trust too much. And learn how to appreciate even if it's just a small opportunity because that is where everything else will begin. Okay. <clears throat> um, those who have already caused you a lot of um, anxieties and fears and pain. It, you will soon get over that fear and you will soon get over that heartbreak because you will have the success that you've been aiming and dreaming. Okay, meaning that you will be getting the promotion that you're applying for or getting. So, good for you. Now, let's take a look at your Oracle cards, finally. Okay, now this is for the month of January. <clears throat> Feb. March. April. May. June. July. August. September. October. November. December. Ooh, su successful completion. All right. Now, January, healer of action. <clears throat> this is a time when you can do whatever you set your mind to if your heart is open. You're being asked to do many things at once. You won't find as long as you know you're making a difference. This card indicates someone is loving, intelligent, passionate, and fun, which could definitely describe you. This person can handle difficult situations with grace. 
the positive recognition, congratulations, your plans have worked out perfectly, and now it's your time to shine. Brilliant new ideas will present themselves to you, and success is all but assured. Express yourself openly and honestly, knowing that those surrounding you are trustworthy. Be open to unexpected opportunities. March is six of thought. Peaceful times are on the horizon. The storms have passed, and now you can see that your destination is within sight. The stress in your life will begin to fade away, allowing for happier times. It may be necessary to take a journey over water or to another country. April, seeing clearly, it's time to view things from a, dis from a different perspective. You have the blessed gift to see past the current situation and envision amazing possibilities. Don't worry the positive the momentum while you think your plan won't last. Embrace your uniqueness and allow it to serve you. May, two of action, trust in your ability to make excellent choices. There's opportunity all around you if you just continue to move forward. It may be time to take on a new partner who can help you be a success in your career or creative endeavors. Keep your eyes on the big picture rather than the details of the moment. June. Messenger of emotion, this is the beginning of a new emotional experience that could grow into something deeper. You may receive a message expressing feelings that you didn't even know were developing. A social invitation could soon be on its way to you. There's a person involved who's very gentle and loving with only the kindest of intentions. It could be you, especially if you're artistic, shy, and sensitive. July, Messenger of Thought, a new topic or intellectual project is really exciting for you. There's so much to learn before you feel ready to move forward. New information may require changes to your plans. Review all documents carefully. You know will meet or are someone who loves to learn and share knowledge. This person is brilliant, truthful, but also blunt and not very diplomatic. Celebration, this is a wonderful time in your life. Difficulties fall away and the light at the end of the tunnel is a star you can wish upon. The timing is right to make long-term plans for a joyful future. Have faith that things are going to turn out beautifully. Six of emotion, memories can fill your heart with many emotions. It's important to remember your past accurately. Without seeing it as a better or worse than it was, people you used to know may return to your life unexpectedly. Children could be an important issue, or you may need to reconnect with your own inner child. Um, this is uh, October. Healer of abundance, never doubt that you can make a difference. Your creativity and ability to be innovative make you, desti make you destined to succeed. Sorry. It might be time to expand your career, but don't forget to leave time for family. This situation involves a person, possibly you. Um who's down to earth with a gift for design or decorating, or he or she is open-minded and nurturing. November, successful completion. This is a time of incredible accomplishment. You're justified in feeling joy, a sense of completion, and pride in the amazing job you've done. You've been blessed with many spiritual insights. Soon you'll begin a new journey, but for now, take time to bask in the happiness of your dreams coming true. December, seven of thought, you've been confused about a situation in your life and now suddenly everything is completely clear to you. Whether the truth was revealed by your angels, disclosed by your friend, or discovered in your own, um, it feels great to be awakened and aware. Feel free, to, uh, feel free to ask for a time alone if that's what you need. All right, so hopefully, um, you know, all the all, all the monthly forecasts will be helping you out to avoid all of those curveballs and then for you to make those mistakes okay especially with the fire sign and if you want to have your own personal annual forecast just go and visit me at my website or you may contact me directly okay if you're having a hard time talking to the representatives of the website so and um you may talk to me live on the phone live videos um we are creating a new platform for that so that may take a while okay we will be relaunching that around june or end of spring okay so you may talk to me live on the phone or the pre-recorded video reading it's your choice and yep so hopefully i already helped you out and uh, i'm really sorry for um you know for the delay oh and the one more thing please download the uh, the daily horoscope it's uh, it's an app by cheetah mobile and uh, you will be able to see my videos there and some of my articles all right so blessings to you and have a great 2019. 
And now you may watch my YouTube videos inside the app of Daily Horoscope by Cheetah Mobile. You know, the good thing about this app is that it's not just all about horoscope, okay? You may also ask your burning question, especially if you can't wait for a psychic to talk to. And this is a very quick and concise, in-depth explanation that will just give you all the information that you really need to know about your love life, your money and finances, plus your health. And right after browsing all the meetings, you know, choosing all the cards, you may go and browse for more, like the advanced forecast for tomorrow, weekly, monthly, and yearly. Now, there are also some other areas in this app that you may find very useful and informative, like their relationship articles and other, you know, um, things about the zodiac signs. And if you're also dating, go and check out your match with their feature tab and choose your sign and then the sign of the person that you're dating plus their personalities you know make it work last long and you know or it's is it just much better to cut it off you may also check out their chinese signs and don't forget to get their birth their birth year as well all right for more compatibilities so for more information check out the description box below it's available in google play and apple play store